Okay, now question 14. Let's give it the function f of x is the point negative 1, comma, negative 2 on the graph of f of x. And f of x is equal x squared minus 7 over x minus 3. Okay, now the solution for the question 14. Okay, let me see. The function is f of x is equal x squared minus 7 over x minus 3 and the given point is negative 1 comma negative 2 yeah, I want to prove que this point is on this graph let's see, to say the problem is f of x is y this is f of x this is f of x and this is x Okay, so now I have to prove that negative 2 is equal, I don't know if it's true or false, the division between negative 1 squared minus 7 over negative 1 minus 3 okay so in the top we have negative 1 squared is 1 minus 7 and the bottom we have negative 1 and negative 3 is negative 4 then 1 minus 7 is negative 6 over negative 4 and negative divided by negative is positive and reduce and lowest term is 3 half and obviously negative 2 is no equal 3 over 2 now the conclusion is uh, this point is not on that color que corresponde with the auction B and the other okay Question 15 is determine algebraically whether the function is even or, or neither. And the function is f of x is equal to 1 over x, x to the second power. Okay, solution for the question 15. Okay. Is determine if the function is even or, or neither. Let me, let me refresh the memory. So one function is even function if f evaluate a negative x is equal f evaluate so the original is, is equal to the original. And this one function is odd function if x evaluate a negative x 
es equal minus f evaluate at x. Okay, Entonces, our specific example is f of x is equal 1 over x squared. Okay, so the procedure is always the same. You replace x for negative x. Negative x squared. And you know negative x squared is 1 over positive x squared. Okay. So when you compare this and the original, they are exactly the same. Now the conclusion is this function is even function. Okay, question 16. Determine algebraically whether the function is even or, or neither. And in this case, the function f of x is equal to x over x squared minus 5. Okay, solution for the question 16. Uh -huh, the function is f of x is equal x over x squared minus 5. Okay, I want to prove algebraic, algebraically that this function is even, odd, or neither. So the systematic way is you replace x for negative x. is negative x parenthesis negative x squared minus 5 in the top we have negative x and the bottom we have negative x squared is x squared minus 5 okay now I want to put this negative in the front it's the same equivalent is x over x squared minus 5 and when you compare this and the original it's obvious that this function is odd function and this corresponds with the option b in the handout. Okay, question 17. Determine algebraically whether the function is even or neither. As the function is f of x is equal negative x cubed over 9 x to the second power plus 7. Okay, solution for the question 17. Okay, our function is f of x is equal minus x cubed over 9 x to the second power plus r. Okay, as always, the systematic way to prove that one function is even or is replace x for negative x. So is negative of the formula and you replace it. Negative x cubic and 9 negative x is square plus 7 
roca. Eh, negative x to the cubic power es negative x to the cubic power. And another negative we have uh, outside is positive. But the answer is so far x cubic positive. Y en el bottom we have negative x to the second power is positive. This is 9 x to the second power eh, plus 0. So when you compare this and the original, let me let me fix the original. There is the original half and minus in the top. But you can write the minus in the front, because the same is equivalent. So it says x q over nine x squared plus seven. When you compare these to this it's obvious that the relationship corresponds with the odd function. Okay, again, is the option B in the handout. Okay, question 18. Again, it's determined algebraically whether the function is even, odd, or neither. But now the function is f of x is equal minus 4x over absolute value x. Okay, now the solution for the equation 18. The function is f of x is equal division minus 4x over absolute value x. Okay, as always, to prove algebraically Okay, one function is all neither or even you replace x for negative x. Okay, let's see. This is negative four times negative x over absolute value negative x. Okay. Negative time negative is positive. So at the top we have 4x. And the bottom we have absolute value negative x is just absolute value x. And when you compare this and the original, let me fix it again the original. I put this negative in the top and the front to see much better. It's 4x over absolute value x and when you compare this and the original it's obvious that the relationship corresponds again by the odd function and our handout corresponds with the option